How's the work going? Our invaluable... Our invalu... Wow. Who's breaking these teeth in for an idiot? Our invaluable Amy has finished three more cases. They're already on your desk. Thank you so much, Mark. Hi, guys. Welcome. I'm SumuK. This is Accident. A very intriguing game. Totally unique. And I'm really impressed with it on so many levels. Swedish countryside, cliffside accident, and a street race. Oh, my gosh. All right, let's do this one. William Maddox, Freddie Weaver, Jason V. Hampton, and Bethany Hampton. Oh, my daughter's called Bethany. This is horrible. This one's already tweaking heartstrings. Yeah, gangster. It's your blow gold. What you looking at? Oh. What was that noise? I heard something. Oh, hey up. Looks like we've got an accident here. And the game is forcing me to look in this direction. Oh no, dude. Oh, dude, dude, dude. Alright, mobile phone time. Crikey, look at that phone. No battery. No, oh, no battery. There's two guys here. Need a phone. Has anyone got a phone? See, I can't turn the engine off or anything. Driver's door is jammed. That used to be a nice car, dude. Oh, I see a phone. Trunk button unlock. Oh, crikey. How do I call the emergency services? Is there a phone box? Oh, there is a phone box. Why didn't I see that earlier? Come on, come on, come on. Time is of the essence here. That's cool. Don't hang up. Return to me. What? Doesn't have a flipping... Emergency flares. That's cool. I've never seen these before. How far down here am I meant to put this one? Oh, you t I haven't got a flare in my hand. Oh, what? Why not just pick up all three at the same time? Stay frustrating that. Surely I need to put... Oh, maybe. That's enough. Turn off the ignition in all the vehicles. Yep. Yeah. yeah, I would have done this already. The first time I got in the car. But you wouldn't let me, would you? You just wouldn't let me. Right, ignition off. Check all the victims. I'm going to check this guy first, because he has been hit by a car with no sort of... He's breathing. That's good. A couple of wounds. Wound on his leg. Still can't do that. under a lot of pressure this time. No breathing. Bruise on his head. Face wound. I think he's our biggest problem right now. Bethany Hamilton. Oh my gosh. Things like this happen all the time. And if you happen to be watching this and you... She's breathing at least. If you happen to be watching this and... You're the type of person who puts your feet up on a dashboard whilst you're in a car. 
please don't ever do that again because I've seen the impact that that can have on a person not in real life but I have been exposed to the damages that that can cause and uh, let's just say if you'd seen it you wouldn't ever do it again oh he doesn't have a sat nav damn it How can I check my exact location? To zero of two. So between South Street and 8th Avenue. Pass the information to the emergency dispatcher. Oh man, I can't even get in the phone box. Get in there. We're going to lose people here. CPR, okay. First aid. Gloves, mask. to act faster. Do you know what killed me there? Or do you know what killed him there? It's so annoying. It really is annoying. These damn flares. Because I ran up the road for so far. Wasted all that time. So ridiculous. Why would you pick up one flare at a time? What kind of ridiculous situation is that? Turn off the ignition in all the vehicles. I have to get in this car to turn the ignition off. I find that quite irritating as well. As brilliant as this game is, there are some things they could definitely do better. Right, inspect. Shake him, check the wound, check the wound, check the wound. Ma'am, can you hear me? Okay, come on now. Check this dude. Fantastic. Job done. Check my exact location step process I'd quite like a hardcore mode as well actually thinking about it um, because it'd be great if you didn't have these little yellow dots everywhere you weren't guided at all you entirely had to make up your own mind what you were going to do <clears throat> the guy in the sports car is in the most dire situation not breathing at all, I guess. I don't think I needed to get in the car, did I? No, okay, right. That wasted a few seconds, brilliant. 
Come on, Freddy. Stay with me, mate. Gloves on first. Open his airway. Get the mask. Pop it in his mouth. Start heart compressions. Let's go. Good. I do appreciate how each country has their own medical uh, animation uh, uh, models, sorry the ambulances so it looks like the cars came down this way skidded over this way pamphlet illegal street race impact point One more clue, is there? What's this? Irrelevant. So I, I, I think there should be something down this way. Clue am I missing? He had his seatbelt on, didn't he? Nothing more in there. Oh, I do so hate this part of the game. It just seems so unnecessary. All the good stuff is done. Oh, he's got no safety equipment in his boot. Is that not one of the clues? Hmm. <clears throat> Do they have their seatbelts on? Good question, isn't it? I don't remember if they did or not. No clues there. Red light. Why can't I click on that? Why can't I click on that? Surely that's it. He ran a red light. Is that it? Is that the point that you're making? Can I look at that one instead? So, uh... Legal street race. Hits the dude. Smashes into the car. Why can't I look at these? I'm so sure that's what it is. What's the point in having those if you can't look at them? Really? That was the that was the clue. The sports car stops in the middle of the intersection. That's a clue, is it? That's a clue? That's not a clue. Well, why haven't you given me the clue? I 
It's, I'm missing a clue. Oh no, don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. I've just spent the whole thing doing it. I found the fourth clue. He stopped in the middle of the road. Yes. Should have been the light, shouldn't it? Really. Jump the light. Hit, hit another car. So dumb. So I think the game is going to screw me over here. Not going to give me the fourth clue, even though I found it, even though it was stupid glue. We're going to have to rewind, and I can't rewind because I'm in the stupid... Oh, come on, game! So linear. Awful. Absolutely awful. I'm so annoyed by that. Now I'm forced to do the whole thing again just because of that stupid... Ah, I'm not happy. Right, all of that, all of that. Again, just for this. At the very least, there should be a, look, clue. Clue number one. Clue number two. Clue number three. What was clue number four? I've forgotten already. Oh, it's in here, isn't it? So, so annoying. Oops. Is it this one and this one, or this one, then this one? Scenario. In addition to several injuries, the crash broke William's left leg. As a result of his poor overall health, William immediately slipped into a coma. His health was so poor that he never recovered from it and died in hospital four months later. That's horrible. Your immediate assistance saved Freddy's life. The paramedics were able to revive him on the way to the hospital where he was charged with causing serious injury by driving recklessly, which eventually resulted in a 10-year prison sentence. Quite flipping right, too. At the very least. Jason didn't suffer any serious injuries from the accident but was quickly released from hospital. He soon became interested in Freddy Weaver's case and some believe his testimony was the main reason for Freddy's unusually high sentence, although no one was able to find any solid evidence. Any solid evidence to what? Just like her husband, the accident didn't cause Bethany any major injuries. Just two weeks later, she was able to return to work as the mayor's assistant. Oh, that's why. She's the mayor's assistant. She's probably having an affair with the mayor. And that's why matey got 10 years. 10 years is quite a lot. But, you know, he did take a man's life. And I think 10 years for a life is... Well, it's a trade, isn't it? It's not a good trade. Nothing about that is good. Anyway, thank you all for so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I hope you're having a fantastic time. 
safely at home with your loved ones. Until next time, take care. Goodbye for now.